this fucking bike night. There's about a hundred fucking bikes here racing. on YouTube welcome back to another video now today as you guys can see by the thumbnail and the title of the video slow taxi whew, he's fucking quick and it might just be the quickest bagged FG XR6 turbo in WA maybe in Australia I don't know I haven't I haven't seen anything about anyone else posting about bad cars but Anyway, I'm not going to talk about it too much. I'm just going to let you guys enjoy the video. I'm currently on the way, as you can see, to Motorplex now. I'm not going to be racing, unfortunately, tonight. Um, I'm just going down to watch um, and to support Slow Taxi or Jaden, as some of you might know him. Uh, but nevertheless, should be a good night. Should be good fun. I'll leave some timestamps in the video now in case you guys want to just skip straight to the, to the um, quarter mile runs. But I do encourage you to stick around and watch the whole video. So I'll see you guys when I get there. And peace. So just currently on the way to Motorplex. Almost there. About five minutes away. Just thought I'd give a quick plug to the new hoodies that are coming out. As you can see, I've got one with me now. We've got the puff print on the back. It's a circle. Um, Addicts Apparel on the back there. It's a bit hard to show in the car, obviously. But if you head over to our website, um, they're up for pre-order at the moment. Got the embroidery there. Everything's up for pre-order at the moment over on the website. And um, if you go to our Instagram, which I will leave here, you can also go have a look at everything on there as well. So just wanted to throw that in the video. Pre-orders are now available and they're going to be closing real soon, probably within the next couple of weeks. And um, yeah. All right. We have just pulled up. <laughs> we have just pulled up. Unfortunately not racing like I said, but we've got enough to party here. He's racing. Slow Taxi, the man of the video. He's definitely going to be racing. Trying to crack that nine. Obviously this is before the end of the video, so I don't know if he does or not yet. And then we got High Roller. He's been in one of my roll racing videos before. Okay, but yeah, I th I'm not sure if he's racing or not. Maybe. Oh, yeah, he's got, he's got um numbers, so he must be. But anyway, yeah, should be a good night. Obviously, racing doesn't start till about six o'clock, I think. Um, so all the boys are just getting prepped up now, getting the tires on, etc., etc., and then they'll be heading out. So I'll see you when we're out there. Yeah, yeah. two pies. Yeah. So obviously. Built box, built motor, all the how tech goodies. Tuned by Monster Talk, as you can probably tell by the banner. But um, yeah, should be good. Wow, that is fucking beautiful got the same type of rims as me but he's um, got the silver ones and that is just so fucking nice man those rims as well are the ones I want I know you can buy them brand new from Ford I remember I rang up and they were like six grand or something brand new from Ford for like a set of four or five I can't remember which one but them on my car obviously silver on silver I reckon they would look so good but they just look so good eh? the silver rims anyway I am off to the shed because I, I need to get a pit crew pass so I can get like the videos of him racing and stuff. So just on my way there now, getting to get the passenger um, or pit crew pass, that little wristband, and then head back over and should be good. Got my pit crew pass, so that means now I can go out to the track 
and actually record him when he's like taking off so I can get some fucking good videos. Oh, and actually they're heading out there now, so better be quick. No, I don't think racing starts till about six, so I've actually got heaps of time, but it's right now it's only 5.14, but they must be just getting ready, so they're first out on the track. All right, so car's almost about to go out. Bikes have just gone out now. We're probably about just over or just under halfway through. We got a couple, look at that one there with a the fucking big wheelie bar. But um, one of the bikes just ran a 9.7. I don't know what it was, but that's fucking moving. Um, but I'm not going to worry too much about the bikes, unfortunately. Sorry if you guys want to see that, but I'm just here for the cars. <laughs> FPV, even though young Jaden's uh, XR6 there is not. I still reckon it looks absolutely fabulous. Pick something more from there from the uh, Holden. So it's tough. The Ford's a bit sleepy. Yeah, oh. yeah, bit of a test of tune there for Jaden early in the night. He's got a brand new set of slicks. He struggled last time we're out. Now, Tash, I believe we are both fans of this VP SS that we see before. Anything in that ca in the engine bay? <laughs> So back off the track, I thought I'd just stay out and get a, little, get a few videos, but um, obviously the main man I'm here to see is this beauty here. Obviously, I'm not sure what happened. I'll go talk to him right now, but um, didn't get a good launch, but he's got a new tune sort of dialed in, so I think he's just like sort of testing the water, seeing how it goes, but um, obviously he'll be back out, ready to go shortly. <laughs> Talk his tuner, he implemented a new tune, he's trying something new. So he's just trying to test it, test the waters of, of what he's added. And um, I think he's just, yeah, ha hasn't nailed it just yet. The driver, obviously, not Rob. He's going to turn it up onto tune four, full send. I think it's like 780 horsepower, 24 pound. So should be good. All right. I don't know if you can hear me, but. Heading back out, um, I just I was talking to Jaden, and he was saying um, it was just sort of kind of getting getting used to the car, getting used to the the new tune, like I was saying. So hopefully now he's just turned it up on his high boost setting, and uh, yeah, it should be good. 
Here's a good one for all the bike lovers. H2R or H2, I'm not sure which one it is. I don't know what the difference is, but it's definitely a H2, if not a H2R. <laughs> A lot of wheel spin, but 243 kilometers at the finish line, that is fucking quick. Let's go a little nice shout out then from Chop Garage up there. I think it is. Lots of wheel spin at the start. That's a PB for him. That was 11.9. Alright, so just coming back out. I don't know if you can hear me. I need to get a fucking microphone, eh? But slow taxi. Just frying the tyres. Frying the tyres. Too much. Too much. I've thought about doing your own, so I was sitting there, built 20 pounds. Oh, off. fuck. <laughs> so that's why I fried the tyre. Oh, well. Yeah, that, 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 yeah. It's all learning. So I just got told. They're actually heading out now with the, the sprayer. They're going to glue the track and then obviously roll it. So they're going to do a nice prep on the track. And then, so hopefully, Jaden. Oh. Like I can't even talk. <laughs> hopefully, Jaden can run a good pass. So. Okay, let's go. And the track has gets a little bit of extra prep work here. Still got heaps of wheel spin off the line there. Ready? Uh, yeah. That's sick, eh? <laughs> Go on, son.
just heading back to where everyone's parked. Obviously not sure what happened with Slow Taxi there. Going over to him now to have a talk about it, but <clears throat> seems like he's still having issues with his like, you know, launch and start and all that sort of stuff. So once he gets that dialed in though, he, his PB is a 10-2, so it's definitely a capable car. And that was with a almost 1760 foot. So <clears throat> it's a nine second car. You know, it just has to get the nines. All right, guys, that is going to conclude the video. Unfortunately, Jaden did not manage to get the nine second pass that we were all hoping for, but it did manage to get a 10-7, which is still a good run by any means. Um, but obviously the car, the way the car is built, it's a nine second car, well and truly. Rob, he's done plenty of cars that have got the same or similar setups that have run nines. It's just all about dialing it in, make like, well, for starters, making sure the track's prepped good. <clears throat> which you know sometimes motorplex doesn't have that but we're working with what we got um but yeah i spoke to him at the end there and he reckons you know when, when he did the skid it felt funny you know you can just tell when your car's playing up or, or something's wrong so he did turn the car off and on that um i'm sure you guys would have maybe heard in the video and then um just it wouldn't let him build boost he reckons so not too sure what's happening there obviously he's got to get it dialed in a little bit more um but nevertheless still a sick night some sick cars out there oh i need fuel and obviously a few of the boys actually ran some new p's that ls turbo or ls i'm not actually sure if it's ls but the turbo grand he managed to get an 11.9 which is a new pb for him turbo 400 turbo LS, um, enough to party, ran a PB that uh, F the, it was like a green F6. He ran a PB, I think it was 12.7 he ran. So Jaden still managed to run a 10.7, which is still a good run, like I said before. So it wasn't a complete failure. But in saying that, that is making me want to get my car sorted and go racing again, because I haven't been for a while and like, you know when you're when you're in that environment and you see people racing and then you're not racing it just makes you want to race clearly but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did please leave a like and comment what you want to see in the future obviously similar videos to this similar videos to my previous vlog video i do want to do some more of them um, but don't forget to subscribe also. I, like, There's about 90% of you that watch these videos aren't subscribed. Make sure you subscribe. It's free and it would help me out more than you can imagine. Thank you for watching the video. I'll see you in the next one.